Hi, everybody, and welcome back to the Tuesday Sports Page. We top things off tonight with high school wrestling. An historic day yesterday at McNamara High School was Alfred Bannister, one of the greatest high school wrestlers in Maryland State wrestling history, was on the mat looking to break his own Maryland State record, which he set over the weekend at 250. And we get out to Forestville for the action in yesterday's match. And what a day it was for Alfred Bannister. Here he is on the mat against his opponent. And you can see why this man has the most wins in the history of Maryland. Maryland State Wrestling. He gets two points there for a takedown. Again, he's going to work his man over. He's going to shoot down to the leg right here and take his man down again, and he gets two more points. This is just a prelude to what was going to happen next. Is here he goes again. He's going to get his man going. He gets his man down to the ground by grabbing his leg and escape by his opponent, but Bannister keeps it going, and he gains the pinfall for the victory to set another record. And that's what it was. So with those victories, Bannister now has more wins than any other wrestler in the history of high school wrestling in the state of Maryland. Our Monica McNutt was there, and she has this story. At 5'3 and 145 pounds, Bishop McNamara's Alfred Bannister is easy to overlook. Level the kid, got a personal foul for leading with his head, and the football coach goes, he's 5'3", of course, and led with his head. I have a freshman football player wrestles, 195 pounds. Alfred wrestles 145. He still has a bad shoulder from Alfred running through him. But overlooking him would be ill-advised. With 252 wrestling wins, Bannister owns the Maryland State record, beating the old record of 249 wins. With more than a dozen matches remaining, he's on his way to shattering the record. I started off rough my freshman year. I went and had 57 wins and seven, five losses. But I think my coming out year was my sophomore year. I finished with 80 wins and two losses. And after that, we realized that the record was in, was in reach. And that's when we, in junior year, 60, 68 wins. And this year, we're just building up. That buildup has already made Bannister a three-time Maryland State champ, an all-met selection, a two-time Beast of the East champion, a national prep champion, and a three-time WCAC champ. And it all started with his father introducing him to wrestling. I remember going there when he was in eighth grade and seeing some of the big names that we looked up to at that time and that was still in high school and, and would sit there and say, man, that father has to be so proud for their son to win. And that's why last year was so emotional, because I never imagined in my life that my son could win the Beast. And he won it, and he won it again this year. So that was sort of cap on his. Whatever he does from here on out, that match was the, was the icing on the cake. But Bannister always kept his eye on the number 249. Pressure was just breaking it. Now I just go along doing my thing now. It was definitely a goal, because, you know, it's a record, and everybody likes having a state record, you know. So when people ask who has the most wins in Maryland history, it'll be me. And of course, breaking the state record comes with notoriety. The coolest part would probably be the banners they hang for me in the gym, the pictures they put it right on the fine arts wall. I still go to this school and have pictures on the wall of me. It's great. Reporting from Bishop McNamara High School for CTV Sports, Monica McNutt. Now, if you want to catch Bannister in action, he will hit the match again Wednesday at St. John's for a dual meet, and then this weekend at the Matha High School for the WCAC tournament. And, by the way, he will wrestle in college. He'll stay right here in Prince George's County and wrestle for the Terps.